Hey, good morning guys. This weekend I've been selected to run the 60 and the 200 at the Nordic Indoor Championships. But the last time I ran in Uppsala, it went so bad that I promised myself I will never run the 200 indoors in lane 4 ever again. But here I am and I'm going to do it. Not because I really want to run on that track, but I really love to represent Norway and it's, it's also a team competition where we compete for points. So after the disaster of my first Indoor Nordic Championships in 2018, I actually won the Nordic Indoor Champs in 2019. And then once again in 2020 and in 2021 the champs got cancelled which means I'm actually the defending champion in the 200 indoors so I really want to defend the title but it's gonna be hard especially on the track on Wednesday I trained some bend runs on a similar track it didn't look that good but now I have to go get a taxi uh, to the airports so I'll catch you guys uh, in Uppsala <laughs> Ready? No. 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 <laughs> you ready? Yeah. What's your event this weekend? 800 meters. <laughs> Uh, uh, generic for 7 out of 10. Uh, then it's good again. Good, but not perfect. So that's the secret to running 6, 7, 69. What's the secret? Oh, hello. Uh, sorry, I can't tell. Lots of them to go a little. Lots of them to go a little. Yep. Andreas. Ja. 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 And just outside we have the arena where we are going to compete tomorrow. Uh, Back is, is going to run uh, the 200 with me and I'm going to run uh, the 60 and 200. So now I'm just gonna head out and eat some lunch and then we're going to do a little bit of a preparation session. I'll tell you more about that after lunch. So we're gonna head to the track and I'm gonna do a couple of hundred meters technical through the band and then we're ready for tomorrow. Yeah, let's do good gang. Evan, how, how do you feel? feel? I feel. I feel. Uh, I'm very feel. Very very What are you gonna do this weekend? Run the 400 meters. Are you excited? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How about you? I'm gonna run the 60 meter hurdles, you know. I'm gonna run really fast. It's gonna be really good. Hopefully I don't come last. He's a little bit lost. Do you feel? 
feel as fast as you look? I feel no. Crap swings. We're crap. Uh, you so. feel crap. Oh. Cameraman in Norway, actually, I think so. I'm not 100% sure, but maybe. My main event this weekend, filming Matthias, and I'm also going to run the 60 meters. But filming Matthias is my priority. That was that for the travel day and the competition prep. Let's move on to the competition day. Today I'm running the 60 and the 200 here at the Nordic Indoor Championships. I've packed my bags, I've eaten some breakfast and now I'm ready to race. I'm hoping to run at 6.7 today. My season best in the 60 is 6.81 at the national champs I ran 6.88. But today I'm hoping to run closer to my personal best. I'll have to do a really really good run. I'm running from lane 1 and then in the 200. The track is really not that good so I'm happy if I go sub 21.4. I'm really happy I think but I'm hoping to go closer to my personal best. The curves are really really tight but at least I have lane 4. Last time I ran here it went really really bad but I'm hoping to go through the curves with no problem this time around and now I'm ready to race. So I'm gonna head out to the track and I'll catch you guys later. So here's the game plan. We walk into the stadium, we warm up and then we destroy the other athletes. Let's go Norway. Team Norway, I'm from Norway, you know, yeah! <laughs> Are you ready? Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. I'm ready. Sometimes I'm not. <laughs> Not happy with this race as I pretty much collapsed after about six or seven steps into my acceleration. This really ruined the rest of my transition and I struggled to get into top speed, but at the very least I got the seventh place, which I was ranked as beforehand judging from season bests. A little shout out to Erik Hagberg who filmed these cool looking shots. Now after the disappointing 60 I just tried to reset, the same thing happened back in 2020 and I'll just try to do the same thing I did back then and get back in the 200. There was quite a while to rest between the 60 and the 200 so I had to do a new warm up but now we're ready, let's see how it goes. And as I hope the 200 went a lot better than the 60, a pretty good start, a struggling a little bit out of the first bend, but a pretty good first straightaway and not too much problems into the second bend, but I did feel like I couldn't go over 90% through the bend. It was a struggle, but a shot out of the second bend, had a pretty good straight and I got 21.37. 
I celebrated, even though all the heats hadn't run yet. I think I was just happy I didn't fall over like I did in 2018. And in total, I got the second place as I was ranked in beforehand. I was hoping I could do a bit more, but all things considered, pretty good. Okay guys, second place I think. Thank you so much for watching. My extra thanks to the channel members. Hey guys, I'm Lasse, and you have just watched Operation Oregon. Please like, subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs>